Perfect grace. Small fields, quick load. Kid Mambo, the last one. Ready to go, 1,600 metres and away and racing. Got them away to a good enough start. Geishka Gold looks for the lead early on. Oriental Blue is a good position. The pink, black and white colours on the outside of them. Chow Chow. And wider out the black cap of pay as you go. Almost gets the lead there. Just has to get past Geishka Gold. He is Magic Race. is further back in fifth position with Perfect Grace. Six lengths off the leader in Nala. Kid and Mambo's dropped to the tail end of the field. The blue and yellow colours. They're about to turn for home, just over a thousand to go. Geishka Gold hung on to that leader, half a length clear of pay as you go in second, two lengths away, chow chow. Oriental Blues towards their inside, it's four lengths off the leader, two lengths away to He Is Magic and Kid Mambo's got an early wake up call. Perfect Grace has got seven lengths to find on the outside and Nala's three away behind that as they set a fairly brisk gallop down to the last 600 meters. Out in front, Geishka Gold. It leads by half a length, but now pay as you go begins to tackle. Three lengths away, Oriental Blue. Kid Mambo's now getting into the race. Got five to go, but finishing it off smartly. Chow Chow's behind that with He Is Magic. A long way back to Perfect Grace. They run them down with 280 to go. The leader down the outside. Pay as you go. Kid Mambo, Oriental Blue. Geishka Gold is in the hunt too. They got 200 out. It's Oriental Blue picks up the lead from Kid Mambo. Pay as you go. Oriental Blue's in front. It's a length clear. Kid Mambo tries hard back in second, but Oriental Blue has the good advantage here under Fortune. Oriental Blue beat Kid Mambo three quarters of a length. Pay as you go third. Fourth to Geishka Gold. Then came behind that one. Chow Chow. He is magic. Further back in Nala and Perfect Grace. Almost like Fortune talks to these horses. He asked it for an effort late in the day, but he was sitting cosily in the field. He wasn't too concerned. But Kid Mambo really make a, made up significant ground uh, between the 1,000 and the 600-metre marker and comes up alongside Oriental Blue. But you just see that, that last 70 metres that uh, Andrew Fortune just punches Oriental Blue out to a three-quarters of a length win from Kid Mambo. Pay as you goes, run a decent enough race in third, beaten about three lengths. And Geishka Gold has finished back in that fourth position. Was quite well beaten in the end after setting the brisk gallop. Chow Chow and he is magic. Was here's that run on with 300 meters to go. Oriental Blue picks up the lead from Pay as You Go and Kid Mambo. Francois Herald tries hard to get him past Oriental Blue, but will uh, just get beaten here by three quarters of a length. The son of Mullins Bay is owned by Mrs. Adrian Guricic, who's here today. Bruce and Joe Gardner, I was just with them the other day, so well done to both of them, Kirk Michael and Greg Sadie. Gary Alexander, the winning trainer. Gary Alexander, stable there, Andrew Fortune, timed that to perfection. The son of Mullins Bay carrying the top weight and now wins his third career win. Second spot went to number seven, Kid Mumbo. Paul Matchett gave us lots of confidence. Francie Herald aboard. Third spot, the eight pages you go, the beautiful looking son of Fort Wood, finally starting to put things together. And fourth spot going to the six, Geist Gold. Didn't look like he stayed the 16, just got a bit tired towards the end. Roy Magna and Ryan Munger. One, seven, eight, and six. That will be Andrew Fortune meeting up with the Alexanders up in that uh, winner's enclosure shortly. Numbers up for race seven. Victory to number one, Oriental Blue. Second was number seven, Kid Mambo. Third to eight, Pay As You Go. Fourth was number six, Geishka Gold. And fifth to three, Chow Chow. Here is number one, Oriental Blue, returning to the winner's enclosure for the third time in his career from 17 starts. A confident ride by Andrew Fortune here for Gary and Dean Alexander. Nice to have. The owner, whose colours the horse runs in, Adrian Giricic, also to Bruce and Joe Gardner, to Kirk Michael, and to Greg Sadie. Oriental Blue, a son of Mullins Bay, was bred at Summerhill Stud, out of the Folksrad Mare Oriental Queen. It's a third win from 17. Second was seven, Kid Mambo. Third to eight, Pay As You Go. And fourth was six, Geishka Gold. Okay, now, you know, before the race, we said, Lyle and I said together, where's Andy? We haven't seen him all day. 
He's overdue to he's got to have a he's got to have a win because Divine Grace is they're still looking for Divine Grace. But I said he's got to have a shout here. But that, that's not the point. The point is here. I'm worried about him. No, no, uh, uh, Lyle, call the vet. Call the vet. I'm worried about him. You know I'm worried about him. He's here. He's in Durbanville. He's in Zimbabwe. He's in Port Elizabeth. Now, are you feeling all right? Because you're, you're not a youngster anymore. No, I'm only in Zimbabwe. You're feeling all right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In, in Zimbabwe, they pay us uh, US dollars. Do they pay in dollars? Yeah, they pay in dollars. And uh, I thought they every, every third day, I go and check yeah. if my dollars are still in my safe. Or if they're the right, uh, you know, they're not fakes. No, 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 no. No, like no, 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 money, money. They're not going to get past you. They're gonna no, 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 the fake ones. No, no, no. They no, won't no. get past <laughs> Well, that's nice to see you because, I mean, we, we, it's quite a true comment before the race. We said he's got to have a huge chance. I spoke to Gary early on. He said I might have two winners. But he's, he's going to be happy going home with one. Well, we're always grateful for yeah. one, Molly. You were sat there nicely with this horse? Yeah, beautiful. Two main leaders, me third, yeah. and, uh, but a real good sand horse. Yeah. I mean, he dug down deep. He just kept quickening, quickening to the line. Yeah. And he won a good race. He'll definitely win again, Molly. Yeah. He's, a, he's a proper sand horse. Yeah, I mean, I know what Munger was going. The horse that doesn't stay, he's gone off to the front like a loon. But I mean, uh, but you sat behind him like this, nice and nice and nicely. And then when you pounced, you pounced. Yes, and then uh, Francie obviously came yeah. to try and even yeah. uh, match it. Well, Chris Herbert's horse. To yeah. try and take the, the, the honey pot. Yeah. But the honey pot was too tight no, on the mark. No, too, too tight too, on the too, too, Absolutely. Glad for the team here? Yeah, Molly. Sheepers, we're still ticking over. Yeah, nice. Uh, yeah, yeah. We're not the greatest okay. horses, but. Uh, People still notice that we're here. Yeah, uh, there's uh, a sale on as well. If there's anybody who wants to send us or buy some horses, course, yeah, Gary, Gary will be there. Big and uh, we've seen some nice ones, Money. Yeah, it's on a Sunday afternoon. I'm not quite sure. I probably won't be. They'll be racing somewhere. Uh, oh, they will, yeah, yeah, but I'll be there. They have a very good bar there, they tell <laughs> Beautiful. Have a, have a whiskey for me, Molly. <laughs> <laughs> you love him, don't you? Anyway, there we go. Well played, Gary. You were confident about your two horses, and this one's come through well, this fella. Yeah, he's uh, always performed very well on the sand, and he's a big, strong horse. Um, and Andrew, I think, gave him a good ride, yeah. patient, and uh, he ran on nicely. Lovely. And you had an owner here too? Adrian yes, was here. Adrian was, Adrian here, was here, and he was happy, so I'm glad for him. And yeah. uh, Bruce yeah. as well is involved, Kirk Michael. Yeah. So there's a nice group of guys. But uh, also to Odyssey Steel, I've got to thank our sponsor. We've got right. a new sponsor now, good. so things are looking good for the yard. You'll have to bring him back quickly before they close the sun. I think so, yeah. but uh, he's just as good at on the turf, yeah. Molly, especially when we get a bit of rain coming into the uh, softer conditions. Uh, you know, Mullins Bay, uh, yeah. he's passed away, but he's thrown one or two fairly decent yeah. horses, and good luck to Samuel Stud. Good stuff, and Samuel, they had a big day yesterday with their gallops, I mean, Nico was telling me about it. He was calling the gallops there yesterday. Yeah, they've got some nice horses out yeah. there, and it's always a nice sell to bowl. Lovely. Thanks, Thanks very much for seeing us, Gary. Well done to Gary there, and... A result of race number seven, one by the one horse, Oriental Blue there. The son of uh, Mullins Bay from Summerhill has won it from the seven horse Kid Mambo. Third to the eight, pay as you go. Fourth, six, Gator.